this was a project that started more than 10 years ago. We, we, we started to think about the translation of the science on the microbiome to the clinicians. Uh, because uh, at the beginning of this century, there was a lot of science, uh, mainly based in animal models, showing that gut microbes have an important impact on, on health of the individuals. I believe that we were only 100 people or maybe 120 people, not, not, not more than that, but was really a very great success. I, I think we, we were able to make this complex science, which is the microbiome science, easy for the clinicians and also to get uh, the, the, the proper information. So, and I, I, I would say that in, in these 10 years, the, the activity has been growing year after year. There are many meetings going on all over the world. So we, we had to uh, prepare fantastic programs, uh, very attractive for the clinicians in order to attract people. The challenge was, in fact, together, working together with the Americans to prepare uh, a program with scientists talking to the clinicians. So uh, one important uh, part of this uh, uh, program is the workshops that we regularly have on Saturday in the afternoon. And it takes uh, around 90 minutes each workshop and it's always very successful. So this, I think this was the most important challenge to attract uh, the people. The analysis of the microbiome is still behind because of the large variety of different microbiomes across people from different continents. So I think the challenge now is to have well-validated ways of analyzing the gut microbiome in order that the clinician can take decisions or have strategies how to treat or which diet to recommend. And the second thing is the tools for intervention. So we expected a lot from fecal microbiome transplantation or, or transmission, as we say, FMT. And there are good data, good studies, but it's becoming more complex than it was supposed at the very beginning. These are the two challenges. Uh, a clear way of defining a healthy microbiome and having good tools for the intervention.